Welcome to the Michigan Golfer Show. Join us each week as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great game. Hi, I'm Jack Berry, and today I am with uh, a man who has, has three golf courses between Torch Lake and Lake Michigan. Now, how can, you, how can it get any better than that? This is Mike Brown from Agamang. <laughs> All right, thank you. Yeah, we, uh, we're pretty fortunate. We're, we live in God's country, as they say. Yes. Okay, now you got three courses, Torch, Sundance, and Antrim Dells. Tell us what's happening with the... Well, I know that this year is the 10th anniversary of Sundance, which is one of my very favorite golf courses. It is, it is. We're excited, and Sundance, ever since it opened in 2005, and first full year of 2006, has done nothing but get accolades, and we're excited to have the 10th anniversary, and we feel that it's one of the top courses in all northern Michigan. Go ahead. Absolutely. More than that, even. <laughs> Yep. And then we have uh, the Torch Course, which is the original Agamemnon design, and that's on its 30, 40th anniversary, really. It, that one opened back in 1975. And you get nice views of the lake there, and that's, uh, Chick Harbert uh, was involved in that in that course back in the early days. He was. I've heard some great stories about him. I was unfortunate I never got to meet him before I got there. Uh, Ryder Cup captain twice, I've been told. 1953 PGA Championship when it was match play. So a lot of great stories about Chick and we're real excited and that course has come a long way since its beginnings as well. And then we have Antrim Dells overlooking Lake Michigan. Right. And that's just, you know, just a great golf course and, and that one's about 40 years old as well and a Jerry Matthews design, one of his early designs with his dad and, and we're fortunate enough to for the last uh, six years to have been running it and took it over and you've done a little bit of work there right we have we have it um it needed a little TLC when we, when we took it over about five or six years ago. We've uh, really done a lot with the clubhouse. We've done a lot out on the golf course. We probably put about a thousand yards of drain pipe in. Being 40 years old, things deteriorate. Um, so we're, we feel really good about going forward with it and are excited to have it in our stable of, of three courses. Now you do have a uh, kind of a package deal for uh, playing the three of them? We do. Um, we uh, Everything kind of runs through the Agamemnon Golf Package uh, Information Desk really and we package Antrim Dallas, Sundance and Torch quite a bit. It's only 10 miles north, it's a really easy drive straight up US 31 and once people play the Torch they love the views and then we send them up to Antrim Dallas and they get out on the deck of Antrim Dallas and they're overlooking Lake Michigan and they're like, they're just in heaven, golf, golf paradise. Now you have a new clubhouse or you're getting ready to have one? We are, it's exciting news, kind of really just uh, for the first time saying it live right now but uh, we've hired an architect and engineers and we're going to be breaking ground this fall at Agaming on a new clubhouse um, probably in September early October and plans to have it open by Memorial weekend of May of 2017. Wow and and uh, that'll have a, a nice view of the lake? It will. We're, we're actually going to locate it uh, right behind the current clubhouse so it'll have a, a pro shop, bar grill, um, restaurant and it'll be overlooking the same view that we're over, we overlook currently. That's fantastic. Uh, I'm sure that a lot of folks will be uh, happy there, and and you do a lot. You do a few weddings and uh, fancy balls and so forth there, don't you? You know, we, we got into that uh, in about 2005 when Sundance opened. I don't know if you remember the old driving range was where the current clubhouse kind of sits, and so once we built the new driving range facility over on Sundance side. We basically were able to open that whole area up, and we have a tent that sits up all summer long. It's about a 5,000 square foot facility, overlooks the lake, and we do the ceremonies right on the old putting green overlooking Torch Lake. So there's a lot of people in Michigan that really have ties to Torch Lake, and we're really the only venue or only commercial business overlooking the lake that much. So we get a lot of people that just want to you know, get married there and have a great festivity. Well, you're the only golf course overlooking the lake. That's true. Right? That's true. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> location, 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 right? <laughs> well, it's known as one of the most beautiful lakes in the, in not only in the state, but about anywhere. It's, it's amazing. We come down here to the Novi Golf Show, which is a great show, and basically we, we'll be handing out brochures and talking to people that we know, and if you say the word Torch Lake, people's heads turn because they just have an affiliation for it and have seen it and know how beautiful it is. That's right. Now, how many miles north of Traverse City are you? We are about 25 miles north of Traverse City. We're straight up US 31, pretty easy shot. Um, and Grand Traverse Resort, a lot of people know that. We're 20 minutes north of them. 
and uh, just south of Charlevoix. Yeah, we're <laughs> 23 miles south of Charlevoix, really. So right in the middle, and Charlevoix is a great town, and Antrim's about 10 miles north of us, so they're closer to Charlevoix. So we really draw, you know, from Traverse City, Charlevoix, but naturally this great area as well. A lot of golfers in Michigan, so it's nice. <laughs> you are right in the heart of the heartland. <laughs> you got it. It's, it's a good spot to be. Okay, Mike, how about the lodging up at, at, at Agaming? I've, I've stayed there one time, and I think you're uh, pretty busy there. We do, we do a nice uh, summer business in northern Michigan. Uh, we've got long days, play golf to about 10.30 at night, and we're fortunate enough to uh, have some great lodging overlooking Torch Lake. We've got some new lodging, some four bedrooms and three bedroom units on the Sundance Golf Course. We are up to about 200 beds, so we can pretty much fill a whole golf course with lodging. Um, so we, we really, uh, kind of our, our niche is that group of 12 guys or 24 guys coming up, whether they're work, you know, work friends or old high school buddies it's really all about the camaraderie they want to stay in the same condo or the same building put them all under one roof they can play cards at night sit around a kitchen table and family room area watch a ball game so we feel with our lodging and the three courses we offer we're one of the best golf packages in northern Michigan terrific it's Mike Brown from Agamang